Let's just get this over with. Craig, Craig, Craig. Let's just get this over rice. <clears throat> over rice? Should... No, that one's weird. We could get a sponsor. That one's weird. Hello, her buddy. I did get I closer. I like saying her buddy. You're not cool enough to say her buddy. Shoot, I'm so cool. I'm cool as a cucumber. Are you? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Your shirt's kind of like an old man shirt today. It's a golf shirt. What do you mean? I think with the whole blue behind it. So he's got like this blue stripe right here. Blue stripe? Look at his gray stripe. We don't talk about that. That goes down the arms. <clears throat> no, it's the blue stripe. Reminds me of an old man shirt. <laughs> we have no viewers. They're like, we are not watching this guy in his blue <laughs> shirt. Oh, we finally got one. Yay, who's the one? It's probably somebody in the other office. Yeah, yeah. Nobody wants to watch us today. Maybe no we're... one wants to watch us today. Oh, there's two. Oh, but it doesn't man. tell us who they are. What the heck? That's weird. What's Doesn't going it on normally with that? do that? Yeah, it does. Hmm. Stop talking over me. You stop talking over me. Sorry. Ow. Stop pointing, poking me with your bony elbows. That thing is like a little dagger. It is. It hurts. What's wrong it? with that? My thing? kid does that to me all the time. It hurts super bad. Remember when we were kids and someone said, You want a Hertz donut? And they were like, Yeah. And then they'd punch you. Uh -huh. Hertz donut? <laughs> I'm like, Oh, that sucked. Or what about the Volkswagen, the bug? Oh, yeah, the slug bug thing. Mm -hmm. yep, 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 yep. My parents used to play that game. Oh, well. Okay. I guess my mom won. My dad passed away a couple years ago. So. <laughs> Stop! But so, well, he did. I mean, that's a Way fact. to bring the show down on a you Friday, can, You dude. can Google it. <clears throat> What's up, Jeff? Jeff, thanks for being a loyal watcher since nobody else. Oh, wait. There might be a third one. We got, we got some Why watchers. is it not telling us who's watching us? It's super weird besides Jeff. Okay, let's just get on with it. Okay. <clears throat> All right. So here's where we got, uh, guys. Nicole was trying to get here for the show. She's a little bit late today, and here's why. She got lost in her own car. <laughs> there were so many chicken nuggets and french fries and half drink gogurts and uh, showing sheets. My lunch from yesterday. It's like a paper mache nightmare in that car of hers. <laughs> just going just gonna to go out on a limb and tell you guys that. So I know nothing about the show. I want to say that for the record. You know how Craig's like, all, oh, yeah, this is all Nicole's show. No, this is all Craig's show. So I'm going to give you your obsessive compulsive disorder uh, <laughs> tips for keeping your car spotlessly clean all the time. Yeah, Jeff. Thanks, Jeff. Sorry, Jeff. Jeff, let's pre-apologize to Jeff for this show. Um, and You're our only viewer today, Jeff. In. I'm sorry. It is. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> so keeping your car clean. Again, we've established that Nicole does not do that. We are going to get a picture of her car and how bad it is just to show you guys, but uh, when I went near up. it with my camera, something growled at me, <laughs> so I'm not sure what it was. We think it was a chupacabra, but... Uh, <laughs> they live in my car. It's gremlins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they we decided... Get the nice ones are during the day when they get milk or something on them, then they turn to the mean ones, the mean gremlins. The gremlins, yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. I cannot feed Nicole's car after midnight. Um, it can't get wet. It'll just start multiplying Yay, and cause Misty's big problems. Here. Yay. Big problems. Okay, so our number five tip is... Okay, you get fast food and stuff like that. You know, they're going to give you extra napkins. You know, here's what I do. I give my son one. I give my other son one. I keep one napkin and the rest, because they always give you like a great, just a crazy stack of napkins. Those go into my glove box, the console, wherever I put napkins. I put them in both places, as a matter of fact. I always have good, that's my, my permanent napkin stash and my new napkin stash. So, do you have baby wipes in your car? Because your other thing says I wipes. I don't, yeah, wipes. <clears throat> you could, I don't carry baby wipes in my car, but. I was just curious. I, if, I I drop, if I drop one sesame seed on the floor, I will pull over and find that seed and get that out of my, wait, wait, wait. Out of my floor. Do you have like a, uh, a portable vacuum in your car? I do not. Really? I don't need oh, it. I'm surprised about that. I don't need it. In I don't, trunk? I don't drop any crumbs <clears throat> in my car. Is no one allowed to eat in your car ever? No one's allowed to eat in my car. If they make one crumb, they're done. For don't the touch. Record. Don't For touch. The don't no. show. Oh, touch show. It. See, look at look at this. My my yeah. My nothing coffee, falls in his car ever. My coffee had an accident. <laughs> it looks disgusting. It tastes Dunkin'y. Nothing falls in his car ever. Uh huh. Wink, wink. Sometimes stuff falls on the floor, but like I said, I stop <clears> and I pick it up. So like you stop in the middle of 41, you're like, no sesame seed on my floor. No, usually I would like make a bib out of a <laughs> napkin and I'll eat, you know, over that. So if there is a crumb, I get to fold it all up and throw it away. Uh, Misty can tell you about my lunch yesterday where I put a plastic bag over my dress so that I wouldn't get it dirty. It was nice. green. I sent a picture to everybody. She eats like the Tasmanian devil. <laughs> anyway... <laughs> That's how we should do that again. The Tasmanian devil eating. I don't know. Yeah, how, how do they go again? No, I can't do it again. <laughs> it's a, it's a one-time impression. The only. least scary Tasmanian devil I've ever heard of. Okay, 
Moving, moving on to number next, which is uh, cuatro for all of our Spanish speaking friends. If you get fast food, throw away your old fast food stuff. I'm talking to Nicole on this one. It seems like a lot. And not all fast food joints have the garbage can after. Uh, so many of them do though that, and I know you get fast food like every single day. You cannot tell me that there's right. never a place to throw stuff away. So when I was eating with my paper or my plastic bag thing, whatever, her I was tarp, eating outside. <laughs> I was eating outside of the restaurant and there was a garbage can right across. And I was like, you know what? I should take that and throw it away. And then I was like, you know what? That's a lot of work. It seemed like a lot of work. <laughs> So, so gross. I swear evolution is restarting in her car. Like it's, there's little like, you know, little bugs crawling around on the bottom and stuff like that that have never been seen before. I'm going to have like, a new form of human at some point in there. Yeah, they're wearing like little McNugget sauce caps, you know, for hats and stuff. It's crazy. Honey it's mustard. Weird in there. Honey yeah. mustard hats. Honey mustard. He's like the king, you know, he's like, yeah. <laughs> You know, and they they got little fries. <laughs> they got little fries for like their swords and stuff. That's cool. It'd be awesome. It's good times. Good yeah, times. Yeah. Okay, <clears throat> if your car gets to the point, if you're walking, yeah, that's right. If it's not, if it's exactly, too hot Misty. to walk to throw it is. something. It away. was too hot yesterday. Oh, I thought Misty was siding with me, but no, she's not. She's you girls not. stick together. Thanks. Fine. Messy cars, whatever. Messy cars unite. Number three. Number three. Dry for our German friends. Uh, pay to have your car detailed. If it gets as bad as Nicole or like Misty saying, it's too hot out there, then pay to have it detailed. There's an awesome guy at a Crown Point. I wish I knew his, I wish I knew the company name, but it's, yeah, you can see it on Facebook, all that kind of <clears> stuff. <throat> He'll come out to your office and detail your car while you're at work. Do you want to know the story Misty told me about her car yesterday? Mm, yes, I would. Her daughter, is it relevant to this? Yes, it is. Okay. Her daughter spilled um, half a thing of milk in her car Ooh. this week. Ooh. <laughs> Been there. And... She tried to clean it up, but her car still smells super, super bad. So You know what? If you like sour cream, <clears throat> good news is you'll love your car. Don't. don't. <laughs> if you don't like the smell of sour no, cream. No, sour cream is so gross. Gross. <laughs> All right. That made me gag. <clears throat> just, you know what? Hey, just get a taco, throw it on the floor, and then boom. Then you got, you got a taco with sour cream. How much time some of us spend in our vehicles, it's great to have it clean. Yeah. I totally so. agree, Brad. What you Misty can... says, and dog pee. That's a whole other show, Misty. We're I not even going to get into that. I didn't tell that one because I didn't think you want me to say it out loud. Yeah. However, Brad, if you want to come over, there's a dumpster like six feet away from my car that I could dump all my stuff in. If you want to come over and help clean it out, I'd be, I would be happy to take the help, man. 9219 Indianapolis Boulevard. Come on down. Man, just come bust out down. your, this is our secret studio. The Nicole Hansen Studios now. I've now heard it called Harpo Studios. Harpo is Oprah's place. I know, but yeah, no one would call your place Harpo Studios. Hey, yeah, What's they wrong did. With you? Scott Miller, where are you at? What you called it that? Into <laughs> <laughs> Jen, Jennifer. <laughs> so what did I click into? Yeah, Jennifer. I don't. We don't know either. We don't know either. Okay, so pay to get your car detailed. <clears throat> Brad says he's pricey. We know, Brad. We know. We know. Drinks at <laughs> Sips and Stones. I got you. Whoa, I got you. Pinky's up. Mr. Just Brad, sad. Mr. Eric's. Um, Pay to have your car detailed. So I've had a lease for two years. My kids have spilled hot chocolate in it. I had. I tried to get my phone out from under the seat the other day, and I was literally oh, pulling out like wrapper. I'm like, I don't even know where all this stuff came from. It was so disgusting. You should definitely pay to have your car detailed. I have not done it. Everyone but it really should. And like I said, I I, I want to say it's like <clears throat> JD or J JD Powers Detail Pro or something like that. No, no, it's a, no, it's a guy at a Crown Point. Like I said, just he's got water on his on his van. <clears throat> like he'll he'll come out and do everything right from the parking lot. He's got a generator on there. Ooh, he give me his he number. Need, yeah, he doesn't need anything and he does a great job. I want his number. Okay. Well, like I said, I, maybe I have it on my phone. I'll it's, get him to come here. Here. Here, fill some time for a second. Pretend like you're doing something on this show. Okay, so number 2 is actually mine and this is what Craig tells my kids all the time when he talks to him on the phone. I don't have it. Make kids take stuff out or it gets tossed. Yeah. <clears throat> oh my God, protein shakes. Ooh, Jennifer, that is nasty. Yeah, those are I could see too. that. That would be disgusting. Yeah. yeah. But kids take stuff out of the car. No, my kids will literally just walk over it and dump it everywhere. I don't know. I'm teaching them super bad habits. Hey, if that's the one bad habit they have in life, I'll be a happy camper. I sat in there, you know, like sometimes, I, I don't know if you guys do this. I do it as a joke. If I walk into a really nasty home, you know, and I'll, I'll jokingly say, do you guys want me to take my shoes off? <laughs> <laughs> Even though if they ever take me up on it, I'm going to have to take my socks off before I put my shoes back on. Like, uh, and <clears throat> thankfully, no one's ever called my bluff. And they're like, 
no, no, you're good. And I'm like, yeah, I thought so. <laughs> but Nicole's car is like, I want to take, I, I want to sit on a plastic bag. Like I just, I just. Uh, yeah, I don't blame him. Yeah, yeah. He went in my car. What were you in my car for? We went to the we went Christmas to the party or something, yeah, right? I, or a we casino. To, yeah, yeah, we went, yeah, I, we had a, we kind of <clears> double dated <throat> you and Chris and yeah. me and a, 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 a nice lady. And then we took, I took the car seats out. Well, I could tell you, so they could sit in the second row and the car seats. It, I did feel bad for them. I'm not gonna lie. Not it gonna was lie. Disgusting. It was disgusting. Yeah, yeah, they were chicken nuggets and French fries everywhere. So, oh. the weirdest thing though is the half drank those gogurts. I don't know why anyone was ever like, you know what I need on the go? I need a, a thing of light yogurt, like 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 a non with five tablespoons of sugar in it. Yeah, like on that's, top of it. That's such a weird thing to me. So like, disgusting. Yeah, I don't know. I don't why want that my kids to get that thing. garbage. Gross. And the Capri Suns. Who's giving their kid a Capri Sun in the car? You got. I can't even get a, that stupid straw in those stupid things. You probably Eventually, can. I get mad and I just poke a hole in it and drink it. You know, like a vampire. And then wood. it squirts all over what the place. What a vampire drink a Capri Sun? Any vampire? I would think they would, think they would just like pierce it and just drink it. Yeah. Jennifer, I like that tip. That's it's never gonna work for me, but I like it. If I could discipline myself for thirty days, because they say thirty days to make a bad habit, break a habit, right? Yeah. To pick up something every time I walked out of the room, my house would be a whole hell of a lot cleaner. Yeah. It is not. So would my car. It is not. Well, my son's Eli's mobile <laughs> detailing crown point. That might be it. Um, yeah, and my well, my when my sons were young though, they were well, they were they were you know they you were also just have as teenagers messy. now, Craig. That's right. Agreed. Jennifer. Well, they were young at one point. They weren't born as teenagers. My poor and ex wife, your, if they were. Your car was just completely clean the entire time you had children, even when they were like five. For the most part. You are so OCD for real. No, I just don't like messes. What's wrong with that? OCD. No, I just don't like a mess. What's... OCD. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> like I go to his house and be like, you don't really need to take your shoes off. And I'm like, mm, yeah, I'm going to take my shoes off. No, just I know if you're going to stay on the hard floors, I don't care about that. Mm -hmm. If you're going to go walk on the carpet, yeah, I don't want you, I don't want your, uh, you know, I don't want you walking with shoes on the carpeting and stuff like mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. But the carpeting's only in the upstairs bedrooms and my bedroom. Like there's no, there's no reason anyone's going to go into any of those rooms. Nope. So. But I always take my shoes off because I know how OCD he is. I don't mind. <clears throat> I wear my own shoes in the house sometimes. I just, uh, my feet like to breathe. I don't like to have them locked up in shoes all day. Yeah, you do Little stinky foot feet. prisons. Stinky feet. I don't have stinky feet. I'm just teasing. Yeah. All right. This show's going off the rails <laughs> it's fast. It's going off the rails. It is Friday for sure. We didn't do a show last week in observance of uh, what's your Independence Day. I had to pick up a boat. <laughs> Not true. I had to pick up a boat. I didn't have I We didn't do, do the, the show last week because I was at my sister's wedding in Colorado. Well, and then my buddy <clears> let <throat> me pick up his boat. So it was like a one, I had to get it Friday. So I just now heard about the boat. He's yep. like, man, I just didn't do the show. Now I find out the real truth. Yeah. Well, no one, I, I didn't hide it from anyone. Okay. Last thing so we can let you guys get back to your day. Like anyone's like, like I can't turn away. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway. <laughs> Uh, no, Tiffany Dowling's watching. Hey, let's, Tiffany, what's let's up? Let's be good now. Tiffany's watching. All right, be in your best behavior. Shh. I am. Okay. No smiling. Our number one tip. Our, what, she, what, what? She probably likes people smiling. I don't know. She's you said we had to be in our best behavior. I don't know. Well, you don't smile when you're on your best behavior? What's wrong with her? Sorry, everyone. Yeah, Sorry, face. everyone. That's Nicole. Yeah, we know. <laughs> but anyway, Shut up. Every time I stop <laughs> for gas, this is what I do. Every time I stop for gas, I, first of all, I only put garbage in my car in a little console thing to the left, right by, in the door. You know that little pocket at the bottom of the door? That's all the garbage you ever have in your car? That's everything. Oh yeah. my and plus, God. plus I also have a backup water <clears throat> bottle in that same spot. So it's like, that thing, there's always a backup water bottle. Was there bottle. like a receipt? He's like, I throw away yeah. all the trash every Actually, time I go there to get is, gas. Right now, there's one receipt from it's this morning. One receipt, and then he's gonna leave that coffee here on this table so we can throw it away later, but. Oh, this, no, no, I will throw in the garbage. I don't let anyone pick up my mess either. So he's got like one receipt. He's like, I empty it every time I go to the gas station. It's the one receipt I got from the gas station. Thanks, Brad. What? Finally, some someone backing me. Whatever. You know? Yeah. And my car's not super clean. Like, there's some, there's probably a couple little pebbles that came off we my shoe. We should in your car right now to agree, to see if that's true. It's, yeah. Yours versus my, we should have done this downstairs by our cars and showed true light. I, I do have three CD Dang. cases on the back seat. I can tell you what's <laughs> on the back seat right now. Some, a bag of masks, you know, the whichever mask you wear, and three CD cases. Mm, that's it. It's his uh, mask from his super WWF personality that he wears. WWF personality? You know, no, the, the secret one. The, the mask, the, the cheap disposable mask that you wear so we don't get COVID. 
I was trying to be funny. It didn't work. Look, Whatever. You know, you know how this works. <clears throat> I'm the funny one. No. Not a lot. <laughs> you, you laughing at nothing doesn't make you funny. For the uh, record. Brad said, even Misty just said, yes. Craig's she funny. said that before. No, I'm yes, pretty she sure that was about that me. Before. I'm pretty sure that was about me. So anytime, you, every you. single time you stop for gas, for you, because it's going to take a while, <laughs> Uh, and you also have a hybrid, so you don't stop for gas as much. You start throwing away some garbage. Right, Kelly? What's Kelly? up, Titus? Kelly, say hello if you agree with me. See? She agrees. <laughs> she said that Read before. The screen. Whatever. All right. So, yeah. And that's that's a good thing. So, for you, just maybe two handfuls of trash every time you get gas, you'll be fine after yeah. about six years. Yeah, exactly. Um, I think that's true. Me, I don't, I don't really eat fast food very often, so. So, I went to go get salt water for my saltwater fish yesterday, and I couldn't even fit the water in the back of my car because I just have random crap back there, and it just wouldn't fit. I could fit two boxes, and he had to put the rest in the back of the car, and I said, oh, my car's gross. He's like, don't worry. I have kids, too. See? Kids. Just saying. It's not even, it's not her kids. It's all Nicole. No, the it's front is Nicole. The back is the children. We're the same. Like Lord of the, what is that? Lord of the Flies? <laughs> Where the kids took over for a while? Like they're on a Isn't that the crash? corn? Isn't it the corn thing? No. That's, children of the that's corn. That's children of the corn. Yeah. Similar concept, I suppose. Yeah, for real. Lord of the Flies was totally different, but whatever. I don't think I've seen Lord of the Flies in a really long time. Didn't you have to read that in school? I don't know. What were we talking about? We were talking about Freddy Krueger the other day, too. Nightmare on Elm Street is a good movie. No, it Not really. It doesn't well, really hold up. It's a series, though. I don't right? like those slasher movies anymore. It just doesn't yeah, really scare anymore. me or anything. When I was a kid, though, they were scary as all get out. I'll yeah. tell you that. If Freddy Krueger was coming after me, I'd just wake up. I mean, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's how you. <laughs> it like... keeps you in the dream, though. That's uh, part of the whole Krueger. Yeah, thing. try to keep me asleep. It's got, like, his claws. I'm going to have to go to the bathroom at 2 a.m. anyway, so. <laughs> Freddy's got a small window where he can get me. <laughs> I'm glad Jennifer thinks we're funny because yeah. I don't think anybody else Exactly. Does. Kelly Titus says, just wake up. You're fine. Yeah. No. You remember the Freddy Kruegers. Like, that was part of the thing. You couldn't wake up. People tried to wake themselves up all the time and they couldn't. Nah, just wake As up. As he came through the phone. Like, he was grabbing you through the phone. I remember he that He can only super do that during explicitly. dreams, though. He can only do that during dreams. Yeah, it was creepy. It was yeah. creepy. Who's afraid of him? Who knows? Anyway, mm -hmm. I'm going to keep my car super dirty. He's going to keep his car super clean. clean we just ish. wanted to get. Compared to hers, brand new. We just wanted to give you tips, especially because it's busy season, and trust me, everybody's car is a mess right now. Some easy ways that won't take you a whole lot of time <laughs> to clean your car. I have three CD cases and, and a box like of masks, thirty something masks, and, and that's it. Some pebbles from your shoes, isn't that some what you said? Some pebbles from my shoes, and maybe uh, the fragment of a leaf. Are you gonna go vacuum that out right after this? Because it's gonna drive you crazy. No, I will not. It won't drive me crazy. I Are know you sure? Are yeah. you sure? Because it sounds natural. like in your voice, it might, it might. I said I'm not coming. Okay. Look, now we're boring people. We just lost two viewers. Uh-huh. <laughs> All right. So those are our great <clears throat> tips. Let's see. Maybe next week we'll do a follow-up and see if Nicole actually took any of this advice. But I will pretty much tell you she did not already, and her car is disgusting. <laughs> All right, guys. That's our show for the day. I want to do something fun because I know everybody's kind of stressed out right now. So. Yeah. You know what's so weird? This is a, a different thing, but I did watch. Let's see. I keep fooling. Yeah, see, Barb, that's a great. That's a great thing. Barb Morgan says, "Hey, she keeps a little box in there. That she carries. She takes it from the house to the office." Good for you, Barb. That's good. good Stay organized. You. I like yeah. it. Yeah, I like it. Not me. Yeah, you should though. You really I should. should. Oh, I should. My my car is disgusting right now, so I keep telling myself for like two weeks I need to uh, actually clean it. You need like a, either one of those pitchforks or like a shovel and you could just yes, start that would digging be awesome. out. Yeah. That would be awesome. It's like an avalanche occurred. Occurred. <laughs> occurred. It occurred. So what was the off topic thing you were talking about? I forgot what it, Oh, you were talking about people being stressed out. And I was like, you know what? I watched, I wanted to compare. So I watched CNN versus watching Fox News and CNN stresses me the heck out, <laughs> right? Because they're like, we're all going to die, coronavirus, all this stuff. And then you watch Fox News and it was like, it was like, everything's amazing. Life is good. Like, we're all looking forward to the election. I'm like, what is going on in this weird reality we're in right now? Ugh, so, yeah. short. Don't watch the news and short. Yeah, short story is I'm not watching the news anymore. I just can't do it. Nope. nope. I'll get it from Facebook where everyone else gets their news from. <laughs> 
All right, that's all for this Friday, guys. Thanks for watching. Thank you, guys. Yeah, thank you guys for right. watching. Hey, feel free to share this. Yeah, right, Barb? I just, gosh, I just can't do it. No. I'd rather, ignorance is bliss, and I'd rather be on the positive side than the negative side. Right so. now, we got too much negativity. It's gotta, gotta make the positives right now, you know? Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go, <clears throat> I'm not gonna watch news anymore. I'm just gonna watch Sesame Street. I mean, that was, yes. back when I was like that, you know, you can always just hang out on Sesame Street. Snuffleupagus Snuff and I was just gonna say Snuffleupagus, yeah. Snuffleupagus I wonder what they're favorite. doing. And why do they say it's an imaginary creature? It's clearly an elephant. Yeah, for sure. No, he's a woolly mammoth, isn't he? They're extinct. I know, but still. I mean, like, there's a bird that big either, I'm just saying, for the record. Like Big Bird. Yeah. There isn't a bird that big. Except like an ostrich. Uh, like what? Have you never watched the show? There clearly is a bird that big. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you guys too. Thanks. We'll let you go. RNN. I don't know what that is, but I'll have to look into it. I'm going to guess yes. I'm going to call it the Real News Network. Yes. Real News? That probably is what it is. Real News Network. I like, I like, I used to say fake news all the time, and now I just say Corona all the time. Every time I cough or sneeze, I hear Corona. I don't know if that's, that might be probably insensitive. Probably not appropriate. Yeah, that's probably yeah. insensitive, but that's... Probably. You know what? You gotta, you gotta do what you gotta do. Gotta say something so we can't post this video. All right, everyone stay safe over there. Uh, Have a good weekend. Everybody's yeah. gone. There's only two left, so... It's what it is. Yeah, I yeah, like it. it Real is. News Network. I yeah. like it. Is that the John um, Krasinski one? That's Oh, that's good. positive. Or that's good, good news, news. Or something like that. Yeah. All right. Thanks, everyone, again. Bye. Right, bye, Barb. Bye, everyone. Thank you.